This is my friend Deb and she's from Florida. She came up to visit me while I was up in Coeur d'Alene. So I took her on a little bit of a tour and then we went over to Priest Lake and went camping. Lake Coeur d'Alene. The college is just behind those trees over there. North uh, Idaho really like College. That looks dangerous. <laughs> yeah, boats out there. And they rent all kinds of things, kayaks, you can go parasailing here. We met a lady a little while ago, so she's gonna go out for the first time. And back in there, that's the hotel. There's a golf course beyond there. That there is Tubbs Hill. They have a big um, hiking where you can hike all the way around it. It's kind of cool. <laughs> so here's a little uh, moose with a little mouse. And there's a whole story. The author of this book, it's Muggy and Millie, is from Coeur d'Alene. And so they have these moose all around the city and they have this map where you can go on a little scavenger hunt to find all the moose. And I guess this one must be number five on the trail. We're on the marina right now. These boats here, they do a lot of cruises around the lake. You can go out like get a dinner cruise or a non-dinner cruise. Yeah, yeah. And then there's the Yoga Mimosa Cruise. Yoga Mimosa Cruise, yep. That sounds like fun, huh? Uh, yeah. Rent boats out, out here, too. Are like you can, kayaks or something? You can charter a boat. That's Tubbs Hill, and you can kind of see some of the hikers up in there. So it actually starts up in the parking lot, which is down there. And you'll see it's very clearly marked. And then you just follow the trail. There's two trails. One's an upper trail and one's a lower trail. But each of them don't have a super lot amount of uphill. Not a lot of hills. A few little, you know, dips and valleys and um, a little bit of uphill, but not a lot. It's, it's really a not. If I can do it, you can do it. <laughs> this is really pretty. There's another little pier you can walk out on too, way down there. See. So you can go for a hike and then you can go for a walk. Yeah, and then, and then you, you go, go for, for a swim. swim. Yeah. yeah. They do the triathlon here every year. You can rent a bike. <laughs> Just do your own triathlon. <laughs> this is my friend Kathy and my husband and I are staying at her house with um, her and her husband. We've been friends for 15 years. Doing the art walk tonight. A bunch of galleries have, uh, oh, you know, they do like wine and cheese and things like that. This is the girl that I interviewed. Yeah, the artist. Oh. I know these people. Yeah? You do? Yeah. Who are they? Uh, Jessica Bryant. She's uh -huh. a watercolor artist. Oh, uh, I thought you said you knew the violinist. This horse made out of driftwood. Yeah, very cool. Uh, Kathy's an artist. She um, loves to paint. She uses mostly acrylics and watercolors, and she's also an excellent quilter. You can get them on Amazon Prime. I think I bought a little set of them or... just to oh, try. Okay, yeah. so they're, they, they're oils, but they were the original they don't ones, and then Windsor Newton came out with one, and someone else came out okay. with one. You don't Whole thing 
is full of camping theme here. So can I try a peach? And they sell them in the Oh, Van Life Diaries. How about that? I just made that by. Mm. <laughs> it's five o'clock somewhere. <laughs> That's a great one. If you wait long enough to make dinner, everyone will just eat cereal. <laughs> when you wake up, it's a new morning. just a boat ramp. Tug's Hill, okay. right in there. Huh. Okay. See, I've never seen that. Yeah. And okay. then you can just go past there and around, and then that's Tug's Hill. Okay. Here's what some of the homes look like in the downtown area of Coeur d'Alene. Everyone always wants to see the feather. Coeur d'Alene is actually a French name and it was given to the Native American fur traders for their expert um, leather making skills. Jimmy's down the street is a popular diner and they're known for their uh, caramel nut cinnamon rolls. They're huge. And they were actually featured on that show, Diners, Drive-Ins and Dives, a while back. Coeur d'Alene has so many lakes, but this is my absolute favorite one. It's called Fernand Lake, and it's um, downtown Coeur d'Alene as well. And I love it because they have all these lily pads. So pretty. I'm going to sit over there and have some lunch before we go to the fair this afternoon. So there's a little boat ramp here. Right. See any fish? Uh, Frogs? Nope. I bet they get some deer in here. A lot of wild turkeys. Yes, they do. Here's a deer my husband spotted up in Canada just sitting on the golf course that he was playing at. And on the lawn in my husband's brother's house in Coeur d'Alene, there's wild turkeys. Oh, there's a dock down here. Yeah, I can figure out how to get there. Yeah, I remember this dock. Where were you when you caught all those fish? What fish? The ones that you just told me about. Found this one. <laughs> what? Kayaks or canoes up there? Yeah, I bet the college uses those. Look how still the water is. This would be an excellent place to kayak. Or paddleboard. <laughs> hey there. <laughs> you see that? They have a rowing machine. A couple of them. Oh, there's a mama and her babies. Let's see if we can get them. <laughs> They're getting big now. I don't think they need mama much longer. Hi there. <laughs> Time for a little grooming. <laughs> I love this tree line center divider here. Old Town Coeur 
Lane. Thanks for watching.